Bring these feet on requires a very specific bit. You can get real close here. See that bit? It's it looks like a uh, it looks like it would fit in these, but it doesn't really fit well in these, and it cams out a lot. So I prefer to use this one because it fits in there really secure, really tight. It's like the second second biggest uh, square bit. Um, it also has to be really deep because because these are really deep you see how deep they are here so if you use like a regular if you use a regular screwdriver bit they're not going to fit in all the way so i like to use these now i just bought a ryobi set that comes with a real deep square number two bit It's square even though it looks like a Phillips on the screwdriver bit this is a square one and it fits totally uh, in there well so I like to use this one and then of course it has like the quick quick release so it goes right in there but if you're using this size bit you can use a number two um, and then a magnetic bit holder I like to use a magnetic bit holder with a lot of a lot of magnet like th this one probably isn't strong enough and each time you go in this will probably release it uh, and you'll have to fish your little bit out of the out of the hole so the reason I'm doing a video for this is that putting the, the couch legs on is harder than it looks if you don't have the right equipment if you do it's really easy so then what when we get to the to the actual couch I see people come on in. I see people putting them on like this. And you see how this wood ends right here? Right here, there's nothing here. So you have to put it on the very edge of the couch. It's got to be like here. If you start putting it here, even an inch in, your your screws are gonna start missing and they're gonna hit into here. And then the legs will permanently be wobbly. So it's gotta be right on the very edge, just like that. And I usually have my helper hold it, uh, or I hold it with one hand. And that's the nice thing about having these square bits or, or magnetic, uh, magnetic magnetic bits because they'll stay on. And then you can hold the couch feet on with the other hand. use a regular screwdriver I like to make sure I like to make sure they're not too tight because you can put them on too tight and screw right through the plastic uh, if you don't know if you don't know when to stop so you don't want that to happen either so I also see people leave this cardboard on you want to take the cardboard off that's just a protector for that corner. And then like I said, you see see the square, um, you know, the, the, I mean the triangle cut off there, that's where you want to hold it. You don't want to screw it in too far because it'll break right through that plastic. <laughs> 